We start with a local company that provides school lunches. They've had to temporarily shut down because they can't keep up with demand. New at 5, KPX 5's Max Darrow reports the problem is now impacting more than 100 schools across the Bay Area. Families here in the Miller Creek School District in the North Bay just learned the district's food service vendor has to temporarily stop serving meals because of extreme production capacity issues. The KPIX 5 has just learned that the problem isn't only for this district, it's affecting school districts across the Bay Area. Whether for convenience, we tried to do five days a week, or by necessity, a lot of parents depend on the school lunches. Many families opt for school provided meals here in the Miller Creek School District and throughout the Bay Area. But just days into a new school year, a major meal provider for schools here in Marin and across the Bay Area is overwhelmed and will suspend service for the time being. I was kind of surprised since it's uh, just the beginning of the school year. The company is called The Lunch Master. It's family owned in business for more than 25 years. A spokesperson says the move is a result of increased demand for meal orders and supply chain issues and apologized for the halt in service. The plan is to temporarily suspend meal delivery at all 120 schools it serves from August 25th to September 5th. This time will allow us to reorganize our workflow, increase capacity, and align our supply chains. As a spokesperson, we will be resuming full service to all schools starting September 6th. We do not foresee any future interruptions with our meal service for the remainder of the school year. Parent Susan Coronado says it's an unfortunate situation. I feel for all the parents and all the families. Here in the North Bay at the Miller Creek School District, the administration is working with the County Office of Education to provide temporary breakfast and lunch options for students to bridge the gap. I feel like we have a really good district. They're always really great at communicating what's going on. Lunchmaster expects service to resume on Tuesday, September 6th. In San Rafael, Maxadero, KPIX 5. We asked the school district if the company will face any penalties. They said at this time their focus isn't on punishment, but instead on feeding their students.